friends, it's Miss Eliza from the Waukee Public Library and I'm here with this week's Teen Maker Monday. We're gonna be making these spool picture or note holders. So they're really cute, you can keep them on a desk or something like that and all you're gonna need for this project is a, an empty spool. So you could use a plastic one or a wooden one and sometimes spools will have a sticker on the top or the bottom so you can just peel that off. Um, you really just wanna make sure that this center hole is open because that's what you're gonna use to make the prong part of your little holder. You're gonna need a paper clip and you're gonna need some tape. So we've got washi tape. It's cool kind of paper tape that comes in all kinds of cool patterns. You can find one that you like, but you could also use regular tape or duct tape and then decorate your own design using markers or something like that. You might also need some scissors depending on the type of tape that you use and maybe a little dab of glue just to go in the center. So all you're gonna do for this project is take your spool and your tape and you're gonna just start wrapping. So you're gonna lay it around right underneath the ridge of the top part and then you're just going to wrap the tape around in rows and you're probably gonna need a couple different rows to get it to cover. It doesn't have to be perfect because you're gonna do a couple layers and it's really just however you'd like. So when you get all the way around you're gonna tear or cut right there and you probably want to make sure that the seams line up so you kind of tear it in the same spot every time so i'm going to go ahead and start right by where i stopped last time and tear it again and then do well i might need two more rows Depending on the width of your tape, it might go exactly, but you might actually have to overlap a little bit. And you might wanna overlap a little bit if you have more than one color or design and you wanna add sort of a contrast or make a different design out of it. All right, I think I can do one more piece at the bottom. Great. All right, so when you're happy with your design, however you like, then you're going to put in your prong. So you want to make sure that the part of your paper clip that's sticking up is the part with the loop in the middle. So you want the part that bends and kind of opens. You want that prong part to be sticking up. And then the rounded end can go right down into the center of your spool. So you're just going to push it. You might have to squeeze it a little bit on one side or the other to get it to go down in and you'll just kind of squish it down in there. You don't want to go super far because you want the prong part to be sticking up. So now you've got your two little prongs and your decorated spool. And then you can add a piece of glue right in the middle, like a little dab of glue in the middle too, if you want to make sure that your uh, prong stays in there, your paper clip. And then when you're ready, you can put a picture or a note and just slide it right in there. And that's your spool picture holder.